My name is Emily. I am an employee at the Rocky Mountain Sewing and Vacuum Littleton store and I have something really exciting to share with all of you today. Today was the day that I got to bring home my special edition Tula Pink Bernina 570. Since they announced these, I have just been so excited to get mine. I was the first person to put in a pre-order and I am really, really happy that I got to bring it home today, including the whole bundle. So I'm going to go through this entire beautiful three box set and open it all for you so you can see what you might get if you get your own Tula Pink Bernina. So I'm gonna start with the bundle because A, it's the smallest and B, it's got some really fun stuff in it, I think. So the box it comes in is the box just for the accessory bag, but Bernina usually includes all the goodies inside the accessory bag, so it's like double Christmas. Oh. And sorry about my cat in the background. She didn't want to leave. So she gets to enjoy the unboxing too. Isn't that right, baby? I don't know what she's eating. Probably not good though, but she'll be fine. Okay, so nothing left in the box. It's all in here. So in this plastic is the Bernina accessory tote. These things are super, super nice quality. Uh, it has a nice magnetic front pocket. And then, yep, in the main pocket is all of our really fun goodies. So first, a little USB drive that has all of the Tula Pink exclusive designs on it. I can't wait to see what it has because I love Tula Pink's embroidery designs. I've been holding off buying a ton of them because I knew I was getting this bundle. The next is some software. The Bernina editing software um, just has basic editing capabilities of designs, but it's nice because you can combine them, get them all set in your hoop before even putting them on your machine. So I'm excited to learn to play with this. I have Floriani Total Control U on my big computer right over there, but I like playing around with all the different versions of the software. And last, but of course not least, the reason that I think everybody wants this machine is the absolutely beautiful scissor kit. Look at that oil slick. Oh, I'm so excited. Now these scissors are not to be used for anything but sewing and cutting fabric. No. You know the old saying, don't, don't use my fabric scissors for anything. Well, now I get to say don't use the shiny scissors for anything. Woohoo. That's nice. Okay, I'm gonna put this all back in the box or in the bag just so that I don't lose anything before I get my studio set up again. Okay, so there's that. It is, where did I put my scissors? Okay. This is the embroidery unit, which comes standard with the Tula Pink bundle. It's usually like, I think it's $1,400, but with the Tula Pink bundle, it came included, which is a great deal. Oh my gosh. That was another big reason I bought this one over just getting a normal 570. So these can standard with every any machine, cable to connect to your computer, um, needles, hoop clips. I wonder what's in this little white box. Never seen that before. Oh yeah, this is the embroidery foot. <laughs> the Bernina embroidery foot is a weird one because. It doesn't come in the box like most feet. It comes in the embroidery unit box because most Bernina machines can be bought with or without the embroidery unit. So that's cool. And it came with a little Mettler embroidery thread set. That's nice. Start phone. My room is about to get real messy because these boxes are like an endless cavern. Cardboard. More styrofoam, more styrofoam. <laughs> At least you know they pack them well, right? Okay, this is the embroidery unit. This 
I love Bernita's embroidery units because they are really unique. The most embroidery units, um, actually I can show you, like my icon over here, slide into the machine. Bernina ones don't, which is yet another reason that I really like the Bernina machines. comes with both of the templates and two hoops. The midi hoop, I believe it's called, which is like six by 10 about, and then the square hoop, which is about four by four. So I get two sizes, that's nice. I have obviously other machines that do bigger, so I didn't need a huge hoop space, but the 770 that also comes in the Tula Pink version um, can use bigger hoops than the six by 10, which is awesome. And this desk behind me is where this machine is going to live. So I'm really excited. So the last box is the big one. It's the machine. I'm so excited. So while I'm opening like fun story, I have dyed my hair a few times before. As you notice, it is this bright, beautiful pink to match the Tula Pink logo. And that's literally the reason I dyed it. I have been so excited for this machine that I dyed my hair pink in anticipation because I knew they were coming in in September. Okay, so like any Bernina machine, it comes with a little cool box that has my spool caps, which I never use extra bobbins, which are great, especially because the Bernina bobbins are 70% bigger. So you don't change that often. Mm, tiny spool caps. A little brush to clean your machine, which you should be doing. Um, and then a screwdriver and a seam ripper. Yeah. Bernina's all come with an extension table, of course, because Bernina likes giving us nice things. This is the seam guide for the extension table. Just pop that on there. There we go slides on there nice and easy. And then of course I've got my gigantic manual. Bernina's manuals are absolutely, oh my God. <gasps> oh my God. Oh, it's not just the generic 570 manual, look at that. Oh my gosh, it's got the pretty Tula everything. <gasps> oh, I didn't know that it was gonna have that. Okay, the inside is the same, but the outside is the part that matters, right? Oh my gosh, that's cute. I like it. Ooh, that's so cute. I love it, love it, love it. I might not lose this manual because it's so beefy and pretty. Um, let's see what else they gave me. They gave me some advertising about the toolbox software they included and Bernina Designer 8 software. My warranty card, which I should probably fill that out. I did get a care and maintenance plan through my shop though because that is way easier for me. Um, in case you didn't know, Rocky Mountain Sewing and Vacuum does care and maintenance plans on new machines. I have gotten all of them there even before I worked there because I love their service. This is, oh, this is the accessory book that comes in every Bernina. It just gives you a nice rundown of all the accessories that you can get for your machine. So, really, really helpful. A knee lift. I like that. As a garment person, I really love my knee lift, so I'm excited to have that included. All of my feet. And my power cord. Probably necessary. So it comes with, 
Let's go through these in order because I actually know what order they're supposed to go in. So the one C foot is on the machine. That is your standard foot. This is the one D foot. It has space for the dual feet in the back. That was another big reason I wanted this machine. I have been a puff person for a while, as you can tell by my icon, but I wanted a travel machine that did sewing and embroidery and had a dual feed. So while well, I thought about getting like the FOF 4.5 or the 3.0, I ended up deciding on this one because it had all the features I wanted while being a little bit more compact and, and uh, convenient for me. Zipper foot. This is my overlock foot. It's the 2A foot. 97 foot, the patchwork foot. Um, this is really good even if you don't quilt. It is fantastic to use for garments because you can do perfect quarter inch um, double rolled seams or hems. It's fantastic. And then the 20C foot, which is an applique foot. So cool, lots of nice stuff. The little Bernina, Bernina stylus that I will probably lose in about a week or my cats will eat. But you know, it's here for now. Um, and then an oil pen. Oil your Berninas if you have one. I have to get in the habit of oiling, so. Um, man, Bernina gives you a lot of little stuff in this box. Before you even get to the machine, they give you some Metrocene Mettler thread to go with that uh, embroidery thread. And they give you a whole ton of various needles. That's pretty cool. Okay. We're past the initial stuff. On to the machine! Woohoo! Bernina kickback pedal. This is an awesome pedal because you can tap the back of it and you can set it to either lift your foot, lift your needle, cut your thread, or sew a tie off or kind of any combination of the above. Um, I'm really excited to have this pedal. This is something I have wanted for a while. Ah, the Bernina stitch regulator. So now I might actually quilt because I have a stitch regulator. And if I can't be fancy, I don't do something. <laughs> So every Bernina machine comes with a little dust cover, but if you buy the special Tula Pink Edition, not only is it just a solid gray instead of being like gray and black and red, um, it is gray with white trim and it has a little Tula symbol on it. Isn't that cute? Oh my gosh. Bernina Special Edition Tula Pink. Nicely embroidered on there. I like that. I put that with the embroidery unit. Um, okay. We're almost to the machine. Okay. This is the best thing. It's the Barbie box. I keep saying like everything is the best thing. I'm really excited about this machine. So everything is the best thing to me because I'm just really excited overall. So this is what we casually call the Barbie box. Um, and what it really is, is a place to store all of your feet and your bobbins. And these magnets on the back means that for travel, it slides nicely into your machine and it stays there with magnets. So when I get a rolling tote, I can just pop both of these in there and they will stay together. And it's nice. Bernina is so thoughtful in their design. And the moment we've all been waiting for is the machine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna move my camera so you can actually see. Okay. The baby is home. Oh my God, the reason everybody got this machine, that oil bed, that oil slick bed of the machine. Oh. Uh -huh. And to get these things out, I have to turn the machine on, so I'm not gonna do that quite yet. Oh my God, look at that, look, how, look at how cute that thing is. Oh my God, that's so beautiful. Oh. 
the polka dots are just kind of like gray and okay I guess I will turn it on and peel this away really quick this is like the most satisfying thing in the universe eh. it's officially mine I peeled off the screen protector woo so I accidentally turned off my phone whoops but that's okay didn't miss anything I haven't done anything yet so turning this machine on Standard Bernina, turn on screen, that's okay. Can't have special everything, right? Oh, look at that lighting. Sorry if I like head it upward. Okay, I speak English. Ta-da. And right there, right there. There are, sorry, I'm trying to get a good angle. There are my special tool of stitches that you can go to the Bernina website and download a PDF of all of these. There's 30 of them, and they are really, really stinking cute. They are just adorable. I hope I'm getting this. I'm going to just hold this right where my face is. Um, yeah, this is amazing. If I go to embroidery... It wants me to lower my feed dogs. And I think all the Tula design, yeah, the Tula designs are all on the USB drive. So that, let me go get the USB drive and we'll, I'll take you through those too. Okay. So on our USB drive, there's Looks like one, two, three, four, five collections. I don't know what this is. Okay. There is the Imaginary Menagerie. There it is. So that's all these animals that are like cool and psychedelic. As well as some quilt block fills. That's cool. And then there is Deer by Tula Pink. Oh, this is the cool one. Oh my God, I'm, I'm super making this. Okay, so what this is, this is a freestanding deer that has a mount. So it's like one of those fake taxidermied um, deer you would mount in like a hunting lodge, but it's all super psychedelic and tula y. So I'm super making that. Oops, wrong button. Uh, next is Unicorn Trophy by Tula Pink. And that's another, oh, that's another freestanding one. So that one looks like it is just a freestanding unicorn that's cool it look oh it's the same thing as the deer except it's a unicorn that's lit i like that that's cool like i'm gonna make that one too pink the quilting edition so these are all quilt blocks i've actually seen this collection in my store okay there it is so these are all quilt block fills i am about to make a halloween quilt there's a good chance I will find a place for some of these in there. Because some of them are, like, these are all quilt tags. There's, like, a can of tuna, a spray paint, um, a milk carton. It's such cute stuff. And last but not least, the Imaginary Menagerie 2. So it's more of these, these funky psychedelic animals. But they are real cool. There's a lot of them, so sometimes it just takes the machine a minute to load them. Yeah, see how many this is? Look at the, oh, that owl. This is, these are the ones that they were doing a lot of the advertising with. So there's like that unicorn that you see in all the advertising, a cat, scissors, the bananas that go with Tula Pink's new fabric collection, by the way. You should go check it out. Yeah, these are really cute. So yeah, that's really, I mean, aside from going over like stuff that the machine already did before it was Tula Pinkish, um, that's the machine. I'm, I'm super excited to get to use this machine. I'm going to start on my Halloween quilt now, um, but go check out Rocky Mountain Sewing and Vacuum if you liked this machine and what I showed you. Uh, Pre-order your own. We still have 570s left. I think we might have one or two of the 770s left. So 
if you have any questions, feel free to contact any of us at Rocky Mountain Sewing and Vacuum. But I am going to go sew and have some fun. So, thanks.